Friends, neighbors, listen to me. Bjorn has declared me Oathbreaker, calling my good name into question. We saw the sail. It would have torn in the first gust of wind. That was a sail he bought from Notfall, carried to us in sea-soaked wood. My wife's sail, he kept aside for himself, to use once he reached the open sea. I am familiar with Gunhilda stitching. That sail was no work of her hands. What reason does Bjorn have to lie? If revealing the truth is as simple as you say. He hoped to turn Harold against me. To keep me from tomorrow's expedition. To hide the truth until I had already been exiled. If you care, for we who will travel with him, this insult cannot go unanswered. He would endanger his crew for a petty grievance. He is unworthy of command. <laughs> Free men of Stavik! Hear me! We must inform the assembly. We must inform Harold Jarl. Only then will our safe return be assured. Are you with me? <laughs> your sail in the mark of the goods Bjorn claimed were ours. His lies are already falling apart. You've done well, but I fear what you have found may not be enough to convince the assembly. What will you do? I will demand a Manyatnata and declare my own deeds as evidence that my word holds more weight than Bjorn's. His reputation cannot compete with ours. A sound plan. I have rallied the wives to our cause and prayed to the gods. Even if you lose, my silver-tongued warrior, the women will make the assembly see reason. I see my heart beat as fiercely as ever. Go now. Reclaim our honor. Forsetti, bless me as I defend my honor. Thorstein Oathbreaker! Come to beg forgiveness with your tail between your legs. Men of the assembly, Bjorn claimed the sail I sold him was rotten. 
But I have found Gunhilda's work hidden, and the sail he claimed was mine came in sea-soaked wood from not far. He sought to ruin my reputation to cover up his poor trade, all so he could claim Harold's favor as his own. Thorstein, if what you say is true, Bjorn is guilty of lying, injury to your reputation, and of an arrogance that could have led to the death of his crew and yours. Yet he was the one to bring you before the assembly. So now you must choose. How will you defend your honor? We will have combat aplenty across the sea. I choose the Manyapnater. Come then. My tongue is as sharp as my blade. Declare yourself worthy, if you can. I'm the finest of navigators at home on the sea. If you're so at home, then it's where you should be. Weak, Thorstein, just like you. I was the first to be picked for this crew. Harold's choices are not worth getting into. Harold would be foolish to favor someone as weak as you. You're a liar, a thief, and, and a braggart, a, a pest. Are you still here? I thought you had left. <laughs> Enough! You both must know that attacking each other during a manyapnar is strictly forbidden. It's time for me to step in. It's clear that Thorstein is the one who has been wronged. It is my suggestion that Bjorn be removed from my expedition and exiled, never to return. His lands and trade goods will be forfeit, gone to pay the cost of finding another navigator with so little time to spare. No, Harald, uh, I... Do not draw more of my wrath upon yourself. I could have named you a murderer and demanded your death. What say you, men of Stavanger? Do you accept the terms put forth by Harald Jarl? We choose exile. 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 Then it is decided. Now come, Thorstein. We have a navigator to find. 